the boat's really technical, um, really difficult to sail and the thing that keeps them foiling so nicely is the control system and everyone hears of this word control system but what does it actually really mean? Well, well basically the, the flight control system is um, from a, an end user perspective, from, from my perspective is a bunch of buttons that you, you push and they send different commands to to the foils, um, you know, so I can push buttons on the wheel that adjust the lure dagger board, changes the rake of it. Um, I also have buttons that adjust the rudders and I have buttons that adjust sort of both at the same time. So it is a very complex um, control system. I think I've got somewhere over 20 buttons on the wheel um, mounted in various different spots and it's been a huge project. You spend a lot of time with um, control systems engineers and um, boat builders, to be frank, in the, in the team, coming in saying, I need to move the button two inches to the left, and they look at you and they roll their eyes, and they're like, what do you mean? How can two inches make a difference? But you know, when you are doing 35 knots and you need to pull off a foiling jibe and, and hit it spot on, if you have to move your hand from one button to reach another button, it just doesn't work. And then you've got a number of foot buttons below the wheel as well, which control dropping and lifting the boards and um, bleeding the cant and all this stuff. So yeah, it's, it's a full-time job at the back. And then sometime after this whole trying to just fly the boat and make it go quick, you've got to think about where the other boat is, if you lift it or if you're on a header um, and your ley lines and stuff. So that's why training is so important. It's such a complex boat to sail and um, we're just getting better and better every day still.